Okay, today we have uh, we finish uh, last week. Last week we have uh, introduced about the IOP some application, and we also have a uh, homework uh, that you have already upload or uh, upload uh, some application uh, some applications of the. IOT in today class, uh, today class, uh, we took some applications, and then we will introduce about the uh, IOT device uh, because this class is open on the information management department. Uh, so. For information management department, maybe have not good hardware background, huh? so we will introduce about a little hardware and how to use, huh? how to use the Arduino, huh? Arduino, and then we 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 also huh? we also find some device. Huh? This is a simple one device that use an IoT, uh, not based on Python. Uh. So we have totally 10 students join the class. So every two, uh, I, we plan to give you one set. Uh. You can do the test maybe on next week or next and next week. But some unit, I hope you uh, can finish uh, by yourself and previous. So in the middle test, uh, in the middle test, uh, we also have one question. Uh, it's you to set up the hardware and dispute, uh, dispute, can dispute and demo here uh, for one uh, one question. Uh, so, but today first part, uh, first part we introduced about the IoT and next class, uh, some student, uh, student need to, uh, because you already upload the PPT file, uh, uh, that you make a uh, five minutes report. report uh, the next mark time is five minutes uh, to share how you find the IoT uh, appli applications, uh, interesting IoT application. It is better uh, that you speak in English. Uh, if you still have a question, uh, now you can miss it. Uh, miss it. English with the Chinese, uh, but the PPT need to be the English uh, because we have a student, uh, original student, okay? Uh, and then uh, at the beginning, uh, today I also prepared, uh, because after introduce this, I review we will introduce about the best IoT Arduino. Uh, so here also has some Arduino. Uh, that I hope every team, uh, because uh, every group, uh, a group may be two students. Uh, uh, it's better you have a notebook, uh, notebook here uh, that to connect uh, to the uh, to the Arduino to test if the Arduino can work well or not. Okay, and then uh, based on papers, uh, we we can prove this. Uh, this is the uh, uh, drones. Uh, drones. Hi everyone, my name is Laura Chen, and this is Newsflash. 
Today I would like to talk to you guys about something that you can see in the sky all the time. Take a look. Well, this no? is an yeah. interesting I'm not talking about an airplane, I am talking about drones. drones. You may think that drones are a new invention, but actually the idea has been around for more than a hundred years. When the idea first started, it was a helicopter with four different rotors. Now that made it huge and massive and very difficult to fly. However, with new technology, it just got smaller and smaller and smaller and hence easier for everyone to fly. So why do people actually fly drones? I have a photographer friend who uses his drone to take some beautiful aerial pictures from the sky. Um, other people use delivery drones to help them deliver medicine or packages as well. Unfortunately, with new technology, there are some risks. Some people worry about the invasion of privacy, some others fly into no-fly zones, and sometimes there are even technological malfunctions. For example, last month, during the last day of the Lantern Festival in Taichung, the city actually used 800 drones to entertain people. However, somehow, 48 of them crashed. I mean, 48, that's quite a lot. Luckily, nobody got hurt, and the police is still investigating on why that happened. So with each new technology, there are some good and some bad things. What are some pros and cons that you can think of for using drones? Remember, always check for no-fly zones before you fly your own drone. Happy flying! Chen out! To talk about drones, here are some keywords and phrases to use. First one, drone. Second one, malfunction. Third one, aerial. Fourth one, no-fly zone. And last one, invasion of privacy. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe to all of our channels. Bye! Okay, this is the basic of this of the drums. Uh, drums. Uh. This is huge one of that to to have a video of the whole city. That is very popular. That control the drum is also the IoT because we store it in the memory of time image and can store on the cloud. This is the the new one. Last week we had told you. Uh, uh, also, we can have many different IoT applications uh, for crossing. Uh, you wear crossing and to test it online. Uh, online. There are many, many different applications. Uh, last week we also introduced about this this image, uh, this picture, uh, that is means that can take a photo uh, automatically by the drum. Uh. So now the drum maybe can be used on good thing, but also is dangerous when you use a bad thing. Uh. As we know now, Air Force 
have uh, have a drum that is no uh, no person inside, but it can fire it. Uh, that is uh, also uh, based on the is very dangerous. And this also an application of the IoT. Uh, that means this device uh, before the 5G. If many people want to connect to the network, but the base station or maybe at the same time, or uh, only 100 or 1,000 people cell phone can connect to the cloud, uh, can communication. Uh, but when people uh, in this area is 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 so much, uh, is so many people here. For example, uh, 10,000 people on this area. Uh, when we have some, maybe have some show or, or something like uh, I want um, maybe double 10, uh, the national day. Uh, double 10 is Taiwan national day. Uh, national day in the government, uh, Government present, uh, government that here, that we have many people be here. Uh, in this condition, if we are now 5G, uh, that so many people want to connect to the network. How it work? Uh, Sometimes we need to add, uh, some kind the of care company will drive a car, uh, drive cars uh, to parking in that area because that is to increase the base station uh, that more people can connect to the internet uh, and access and this uh, is the innovation machine uh, now he hope that this device is like a base station uh, that he can fly to some area uh, and stay here, uh, stay here, and then have a signal uh, and transport uh, so you can connect the uh, internet. Uh, internet. Uh, this is also an IoT. Uh, but this device currently uh, now has product, uh, product. As we know that previously he had show in America that people uh, drive like this, uh, go through the deck, fly through, uh, fly through the deck. Uh. This is can for personal flying. Uh, that you can use the machine flying on the on the space uh, on the space. Uh, that is. Uh, Interesting, uh, but that for personal. Also, that you need to be very careful. Uh, if the machine is broken, uh, you are very, uh, also very dangerous. Uh, maybe we have some safety device or uh, safety for the people to use this device. And another topic about the IoT uh, is the physical social data analysis. Uh, that physical social data analysis that means uh, that we have uh, data. Uh, we have uh, for the data need to consider security, uh, reliability, trust, and privacy. Uh, privacy. And we also need to have a data burden on uh, networking and communications. Uh, communications. And then also have uh, to support the social uh, social social impact. Uh. For the social impact, economy, values, and reality, and service and some applications. Uh, 
Now we hope to which call social data analysis. Uh, that means the IoT device, they collect physical data, but the data can be analysis. This analysis may be for the social applications. Uh, social applications. Uh, for example, uh, this is a cyber physical system. Uh, now, Pokemon Go. Uh, uh, in Chinese, we say Pokemon. Uh, that is the physical. Uh, physical is the background. Uh, the background is the physical. Uh, the object. Uh, the object. Uh, the object is a cyber. Uh, cyber. Uh, because this is not real one. Uh, not real one. Uh, we say this is like a cyber physical system. So a cyber physical system that he has combined cyber space, physical space, and then uh, and then can have some applications. Uh, some applications. So we name that is a cyber physical system. Uh, so many many infrastructure or many many fat Facial company. Uh, now, when they want to buy some machines, uh, now sometimes they may be of the vendors provide the cyber physical uh, to look how about in the future uh, this product in our company. Uh, this is like we say the IKEA. Uh, uh, we have watched the video uh, about IKEA. Uh, that is like uh, uh, we have a physical space, uh, maybe on the living room, on the bedroom, uh, bedroom. Uh. And we have a cyber. The cyber is the product uh, combined with the real environment. And then we can make different type of applications. So that is based on your idea. Uh, that became the, uh, became the IoT, one of the IoT applications. So, so cyber physical system, if we combine with social, uh, for, the, for the social applications, we say that is a cyber physical social system. Uh, that include the uh, control management, testing, eva evaluation, training, and learning have an uh, artificial enterprise in cyberspace, uh, do your enterprise in physical space. So this is a combined physical and cyber together uh, to do some application. And for this application can be used on social. Uh, that became, we say, the cyber physical social systems. Here are some of the, the device for the sensors. Uh, sensors. In this product, uh, I will give to you also have many have uh, many different kind of the uh, sensors. Uh, for example, you have uh, laser sensors, uh, light sensor, temperature sensor, uh, and and then sound sensor, and the uh, radar sensors. Uh, different kind of sensor can be used. And here is the programmable device of the sheer great tools. Uh, uh, this is uh, one bar, uh, uh, one bar, and the sensor usually very small. Uh, this sensor is uh, the, the Nike. Uh, uh, I see now have some shoe, 
uh, now you can have uh, this sensor inside uh, inside your shoe and to connect uh, to your cell phone uh, cell phone and this is the hand ring uh, this is the ring uh, that can connect to the cell phone uh, and this is different kind of sensor uh, this is the deeper uh, deeper detail uh, that can do monitor this is to test your 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 blood uh, okay? or take your some medicine uh, medicine problem uh, by this key uh, that is test the by this key uh, by this key means the Tangneo B when you test your blood uh, then they can transport uh, the data to the cloud automatically uh, because if one person has the digestive like, problem uh, not every day before eating and after eating you need to test your sugar uh, sugar index uh, and then transport uh, transport now have a product uh, now already have product but many research uh, an IOT application on medical also hope to design uh, design the device now don't need to uh, injection uh, injection your skin uh, not just on the sensor or just from the color or your heat and some information to make decisions uh, and this is the like the Apple Watch uh, Apple Watch uh, like the watch to do the sensor uh, and do the control uh, so different kind of applications uh, another machine is like this home daily life device uh, hot daily life device for IoT uh, business and public infrastructure healthcare uh, like this this is the the weight uh, weight detection uh, detection your weight or your body uh, your your body information uh, and this machine uh, it also can automatic to control uh, control your coffee uh, coffee uh, and connect with some IoT device and connect. This is the middle uh, middle intelligent middle uh, that the middle like the like the screen uh, like the computer screen uh, it can change color it can then you talking with the model uh, and also the brush toothbrush uh, also can be the IoT device inside to test your children have a uh, have brush teeth or not the day uh, it can automatically regularize uh, so many IoT applications are uh, real use uh, real use and then uh, IoT can be the people connect to things. Uh, this is the IoT. Uh, we have detect the ECG. Uh, ECG means that detect your detect your health condition. Uh, your breath, uh, or your blood, and some information. We can have the uh, motion sensor uh, different kind of motion sensor uh, this sensor can communicate with the cell phone uh, this cell phone can connect to the internet uh, and then go to the uh, the hospital uh. so 
in the future, uh, maybe everyone, uh, everyone on the cloud, you have uh, your health information, and that can connect with your sensors. Uh. As we know, in Taiwan, uh, in Taiwan, we can download, uh, download an uh, app. Uh. That app already record, recognized. Uh, during or uh, maybe during a period of time that like you eat what time you go to the hospital uh, or clinic uh, and then they give you what kind of medicine uh, all the information we can download uh, because Taiwan have the health care uh, health care system uh, that for the for the people, everyone have a count. Uh, so we have the medical card records. Uh, all in the cloud. Uh, so you can download a app to record the medicine you already eat. Uh, you can see the information. So this is the personal information. So in the future, uh, in maybe currently there are many conditions that people uh, suddenly, suddenly maybe the heart, heart problem uh, he pass away uh, very quickly because the heart rate may be sometimes uh, out of control uh, his heart rate. Uh, so the ECG uh, try to monitor the heart rate, uh, heart rate. I also have a co-worker uh, that he only 40, maybe at that time, he only 42 years old. Uh, his wife is a, a nurse. Uh, his wife is a nurse. He is a strong and running is very quickly. Uh, so at that time, uh, he go to school, uh, running the field, uh, for maybe running a period of time and then run back to his home. Uh, but just a sick, uh, not, not, a sh not a long time, uh, he, his heart rate is stuck. Uh, and pass away, uh, pass away. Uh, at that time, his wife uh, also beside him, but still cannot uh, help him, uh, help him. Uh. So maybe at that time we cannot, uh, make usually to detect the change of heart rate. Uh. Uh, if we can have the more information or more alternate uh, for the hardware uh, that will be better. Uh. So now I I watch it this year uh, we said we have the product. Now product also in Taiwan is legal uh, to detect your your ocean in blood uh, ocean in blood share long to also in blood means that if the the value is low, uh, that may be means your organ cannot get get the osmium. So that will be dangerous. Uh, that will be dangerous. Uh. So this is about people connect to things. Uh, and we also can have seen connect to things. Uh, IoT also important part is seen to seen, means end to end, uh, machine to machine uh, connection. What is end to end? For example, uh, here, here is a car. Uh, this car is driving. Uh, 
and maybe this this is a this car uh, and then this car can connect it uh, to detect uh, with some car whose car is not follow the rule uh, driving not follow the rule uh, he can understand uh, because he cannot see uh, he just have the information from the machine uh, and this machine transport data and then transport here uh, so another is when you drive in uh, your car will call you uh, now your car your car the gas is run out uh, near run out automatic and he understand the car understand uh, which gas station is near uh, near on the road and lead you to go to the gas station uh, that is machine to machine communication uh, so many IoT applications also are based on machine to machine uh, machine to machine because we cannot monitor every time uh, uh, any times so sometimes we need to let machine help us to monitor only at the maybe have an accident or some event happen that need to pass this information to the people that is became machine to people uh, so we send people to machine uh, machine to machine and then a machine to people uh, this is the IOT uh. the IOT usually need have uh, sensors uh, sensors the sensors not transfer data sometimes if this area no internet uh, no internet maybe uh, under some area no network here uh, uh, maybe also no no enough information or the signal is too small so at this time uh, when we want to do the system sometimes previous we need to set up the network uh, network environment uh, and so many research uh, focus on the network a period of time is more focused on sensor uh, sensor we said the uh, at hub uh, at hub data transfer data transfer from this node to another node uh, this is the single node uh, computer service and user uh, the network tightly run low power device consists of one or more sensors could be different type of the sensors uh, sensors so SIM also can connect to the internet uh, internet so we say now many devices already can connect to the internet uh, more than 50 billion, uh, uh, billion so now also have uh, some software uh, that you can set by yourself uh, to connect automatic to the cloud uh, and then to your cell phone uh, so we also will help you to implement a system uh, that detect some data and then store on the cloud uh, and when some event happen uh, that the cloud will send the message to your cell phone your cell phone may be on your night uh, or your WeChat uh, or some password uh, some device to let you know what happened, uh, what happened. 
So this also the trend, uh, the trend of time, uh, the software uh, technology trend. Uh, so, so 5G uh, uh, now is a physical world where uh, ubiquitous position, a period of time, many research on uh, ubiquitous computing. Uh, but now it's not so hard. Now more hard is about the application of the edge computing. Another is the security and the IoT applications. Uh, also important. Uh, so we can find now many applications uh, on this way. Uh, so cloud platform, big data, uh, big data analysis. Uh, as measure of IoT application with additional information and multi multi model function and intelligent data processing and its enhanced theory wireless and many IoT. Uh, I hear if you like you uh, we will introduce about some IoT applications. Here is the the main talk. Uh, that is just transform uh, from Chinese to English. Uh, that no meaning on English, no this part. Uh, main talk means when you have a patient, uh, uh, that we have a baby, uh, baby, that to detect the baby condition. Uh, so this device, uh, this device can be put uh, um, on the patient's part, skin, uh, and then uh, he said the power system is safety for the baby, uh, but he can detect uh, he has different size. He can connect it with the Bluetooth. Uh, all the baby behavior, uh, he can record on the app. Uh, app. Uh, that, that is about different country may be limited uh, by the product to use. Uh, uh, because this kind of product need to have very carefully uh, because that is for people. Uh, uh, so when we do some research about heresy, uh, that need to in Taiwan also need to the the community to agreement. You can do the research uh, research because that relative the personal health problem, okay. And then this is also now many car uh, use this one, uh, use cell phone to open your car, uh, open your air condition remotely. Uh. And then uh, what am I doing uh, that we can have uh, activity recognition uh, right next side is hardware. Uh, hardware. Now, uh, hardware. Right side is the software. Uh, software. So the activity uh, fusion upgrade that for IoT now combined uh, with the hardware and software. For example, the dark light, indoor outdoor light control. Uh, that can be by cell phone, by the voice, by some intelligent device can understand, uh, can be application. Uh. And now I I see many young students uh, not buy an expensive ear, uh, ear or earphone, uh, earphone uh, that that is wireless, uh, uh, wireless, that I think young students uh, like to use that. When I will 
when I, when we went to the MRT, oh, you can find many young students oh, use the the ear, oh, the uh, sound ear detection, oh, that not very convenient, oh, convenient. And this also can help a crowd for weight management by weight scale. Oh, that can test the body information. Oh, this product may be around, around 10 years, I think 10 years ago. Oh, uh, we, we have a company oh, to set up. Oh, and now this product also on sale on the market. And our students oh, designed the IoT oh, and the software oh, that combined with this, oh, with this. And then oh, we also have a student, or oh, undergraduate student, that uh, have heard that to detect, uh, to detect uh, that this is for different, uh, different product that may be on the West, West store or, or some, some store that has some product that people to detect which, which product people are more interested, uh, more interested. That can also use um, the art, uh, art of uh, that to detect which, which the draw, drawing, uh, which the graph is more people like. And this we also have uh, can have design and uh, circuit. Uh, that can use your cell phone. Uh, to set up uh, the time, what time the circuit will turn on, what time will turn off, uh, you can control remotely uh, now by the internet. For example, I am here, uh, I use my app, I can control uh, the circuit in my home, uh, the power on or power of uh. this also we have made a product on our lab uh. this product is used the RFID tag uh. this product also has a pattern, uh, pattern. Uh. and then uh, we just put this uh, put on this uh. Uh, this can this can test the weight uh, and understand uh, who uh, drink how much water uh, already. Uh, that can automatically, uh, because that is combined with the crowd uh, to make uh, communications. Okay, this is the topic about uh, we say some IoT applications. Uh. Another part uh, we introduced about the uh, Arduino. Uh, Arduino. That in this part, uh, that the Arduino uh, is uh, because that is more easy for people to use. Uh, today you need to have, uh, every student need to have to test. Or the Arduino can work or not. Huh? So let's understand what the Arduino work first. Huh? First, now Arduino may be from even elementary school 
all the senior high, junior high school that can use the perka. But sometimes, uh, uh, because many education, they said uh, we need to debate the, the, with the STEAM. Uh, STEAM means science, technology embedded in education. Uh, so that student had the idea of the best science uh, knowledge. Because in our daily life, many products are based on science. Uh, based on science. So the training of students uh, had the best idea of this. And and this is from Italy, uh, Italy uh, that they, they designed uh, design the, the Arduino board first, uh, Arduino board, that is the tip of the tip. But this Arduino board is not expensive, uh, just maybe, uh, just maybe 10 US dollar, uh, you can buy have one, huh? uh, you can have one. Huh? So that is their goal that people can easy to get it, to use it, and have a knowledge about the IoT. Huh? So that is very popular. And this Arduino can be controlled by, by their their environment. Huh? Also, you can control by Python program. Huh? So, in our class, huh, this product, huh, this product for you also based on the Python code. Huh? Python code. If you never learn about Python, huh, because the IoT just use a part of the Python code, not all of them. Huh? So you just have any kind of the program background can understand how to use it. Huh? So I hope to understand huh? everyone has been ever learned about the Python. Your have do you have learning Python? Previously, please raise your hand. You have learned Python the two hands. Ah, so half of students have the Python. Ah, huh? have the Python. Ah, huh? but that is also very similar. Ah, huh? maybe you learn Python, but you not learn about the IoT of Python. Ah. Huh? Uh, because that can make a little different. Uh. Arduino is the go-to gear for artists, uh, artists, student, and anyone with greater dream. Uh. That is a very simple. Uh. Those out of another portable uh, and that teaching students how to use it, uh, how to use it. Uh. And next class, uh, we begin introduce about the uh, Arduino. Uh. And then we hope you also share some innovation, uh, innovation about your IoT, uh, IoT device. Today we have an uh, online testing uh, that begin on um, four, uh, four. The online testing is very easy. Uh, the before, um, yeah, you not post the new one again. Where is the new one? Oh, still don't have finished. Yeah. Next question. Okay. It's only have, one question. Yeah. We, have, we have another one. Oh. Okay. Today we have a uh, test kit. Maybe uh, on the 
Thus class attain on. Unlike we have four or six questions on. Now just online to answer. Okay, take a break. 我们第。